Ooh, man, this is. Oh, this is brilliant. This is brilliant. And I know that for a fact this LP is gonna piss off a lot of non Half Life. Well, it's gonna piss off a lot of people who are. Oh, very com. I mean, very comfortable. Whoa, I am running a lot faster now. Okay, that's quite creepy. Cre Why does he creepy? Um, I got the toilet paper to give to you, and I can't see you, but I can see your shoe, even though you got two, and two is plural. The rhymes are plural, so I'm gonna start rapping. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this guy is on the toilet and he's got no wipes. Something, something, nothing rhymes with wipes. Why do I keep saying words that don't rhyme with wipe? I mean, that don't rhyme with any. I need to find toilet roll, toilet paper. Oh, can I open one of these? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna find him some toilet paper. Oh, <gasps> there is. Can I pick it up? Minor emergency? What does that even mean? Oh, there you go. Oh, thank heavens! <laughs> dire need of <laughs> Brownie in motion. I had a feeling that'd be an achievement. What's the point of that door? I guess it's not a door. It's just a pillar in the way. I run really fast. Time, it was Mark three. I am. Um, uh, I, I, I don't. I don't. I, I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. Um. Five. Okay. All right. Why do doors have to be so angry all the time? I'm going the wrong way again. This guy runs fast. Hey, let me through. Go right on through, sir. Thank you. Whoa! Like you're in the barrel today. I'm in the barrel today, uh, every day. I don't know what that meant. Responsible. Black Mesa Reza is a proud sponsor of the New Mexico Adopt a Highway Litter Campaign. Together we can keep Black Mesa clean. Oh. Okay, sorry, but I don't have a, I don't have a lab coat. Oh. Okay. Ha ha ha! This is exciting. I don't, I don't even know how long this game is, to be honest. That was probably not a good idea. Oh, I guess it was. But, oh wait, no, no, it wasn't. I thought the elevator was like gonna break down. What am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing. Whoa, loading. Uh, you know, I, don't, I think I might have said this already. Oh, not responding again. Stop it, you're scaring me. Why does it keep going to not responding when it loads? That's gonna become annoying. That's gonna become a problem. Hey, you doing science? It's nothing to worry about. Hmm. Fluctuations are well, they're not good. I know that for sure. I don't know much about fluctuations. I can't even say I can't even pronounce fluxu. Fluxu, alright. Flux you. Can you access the mail, sir? Okay. Ah, Gordon. Anyway, see you later. That doesn't count as a conversation. We've just sent the sample down to the test chamber. Is that the real voice actor? I to itch my ear. It's itchy. The administrator is very concerned that you get it's got a of today's sample. Oh, he went to some lengths to get it. I think I'm going a bit too excited over this. In the test chamber. Right. Chamber. I'll walk you down. Let's go to the test chamber. I can't believe this is Dr. Kleiner. Eli has been busy making <gasps> Eli. new experiment. Eli Whitney? Why does he Whitney? That's a different person totally, I think. Eli. Morning, Izzy. I trust this morning. That's definitely not the same guy. Gordon. Good morning. I'm glad you're here. These last minute changes. They're, they're a bit strange to just oh. Then again, the voice actor for him is a really old guy, so I'm not surprised. And again, because he's really old, I doubt he gets much work, so <coughs> I'm pretty sure he's still alive. It was never meant to do this in the first place. <laughs> I had a feeling. 
breaking equipment. It's nothing we can't handle ourselves, Eli. What, what's in there? Run along, Gordon. We'll be but a moment. Run along? It's the most condescending thing you could say to me. I'm a scientist. Do you mind if I ask you a hypothetical question? You know, you repeat yourself sometimes. Is he like, having a quiet conversation with him about me? I'm gonna stealth. Wait. I can't get I can't get in here. I thought he was about to have a conversation. This could take a bit longer than I anticipated. Actually, no, I don't think that is Dr. Kleiner's real voice. I haven't heard it in a little while, so... Oh. So, you, you'll have to forgive me on this error. I wonder when he meets Lamar. Not um, the head crab, the singer. No, oh, I mean, everyone's got to meet Lamar at some point. I haven't yet, but it's going to happen eventually. The radiation level is off the charts. I bet. Oh. I've got two PhDs and an Ersted medal that I find myself doing work best <coughs> for an intern. Uh. You do very meaningful work here. Really? Push that button. Walk over here. Push this one. Oh. Stand and stare at the screen. <laughs> Walk back over there. Push another button. Again. Come now. You're overreacting. <sighs> I don't know how much longer I can abide these perfunctory tasks. I need more time for myself. Uh. Don't kid yourself. You wouldn't know what to do with free time if you even had any. Yeah. <laughs> Tears it. I'm going to check with the office upstairs and see how many vacation days I've accrued over the past 25 years. It's high time I took a break from all this. Certainly. But before you do, activate the electron multiplier and report the reading from the micro channel plates. Ha <laughs> ha. That's depressing. He's gone. I've always wanted to visit Cleveland. I like the pause there, like that was a really dramatic thing. Like he was gonna see the moon or something. I oh, there you are. Everybody's been looking for you, hombre. Hombre? <gasps> is that Bonnie? <gasps> oh god, I hope not. Bloody hell. It sounds oh, like him. Here he is. I'm not doing very good for time, am I? I mean this is part two and I'm not even in the I'm not even in the life changing room yet. This is a rare opportunity for us. This is the purest sample we've seen yet. And potentially the most unstable. Now, now, as long as we follow standard insertion procedures, everything will be fine. Yeah, it's not going to be fine. You can say that. Although, Whoa. I will admit that the possibility Whoa. of a resonance cascade scenario oh. is extremely unstable. Yeah, a resonance cascade. I just don't Gordon feel... doesn't need to hear <gasps> This, he's a highly trained professional. Mm, exactly. We've assured the administrator that nothing will go wrong. And yeah, nothing will. Yes, you're right. Gordon, we have complete confidence in you. And I, you, whoever well, you are. Go ahead. Let's let him in now. Oh no. I don't like this at all. I'm not a fan of this. Explosive! Hey, this room seems pretty safe. I mean, I've already played this part of the game before, but you don't have to be a fan of the series to know what this room is. Well, to Testing. know what happens. Testing. <coughs> Everything seems to be in order. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, well, Gordon, your suit should keep you comfortable. Get off, get the get off the ladder. What? Not that high. Oh god, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. I'll have to go up there anyway. That's something I've always had a problem with Half-Life. Getting off ladders can be a bit annoying. Or maybe that's just me. Maybe I'm just an idiot. Oh, probably. I would be an idiot to criticise Half-Life. <laughs> I don't know if we, I don't even know if I was joking there or not. Um, can I leave now? Um, you know, I've done my job here. I can leave. Uh, you know, I can leave. I've uh, I've done my job. Oh God! What do they just do? Is that? Well, I don't know what I'm doing. Uh -huh. 
Oh god. It's probably not a problem. Probably. I don't like this room. I don't like how vibrate it is and earth shattering it seems. It's like I'm inside a giant jackhammer. Um. Ah. Uh, so um. Am I supposed to press another button? Oh, as soon as I get up the ladder, something happens on the ground. Of course. We. That's what I was thinking! Oh no. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh, what's going on in there? Oh. <laughs> Fire. Uh. Just, 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 just do the amnesia trick. It's not happening, it's not happening. Oh, it's happening. Everything's going green. Whoa! I just got zapped. I don't know what zapped me. Well, I'm back alive. <gasps> Here, what's this? Oh no. Um. Vortigons? Oh, he disappeared. I don't think he was meant to do that. Um, uh, if this stops responding again. There we go! Then you're gonna click the mouse that time, so I think that might be why. If I just take my hands off the mouse next time, that might not happen. Unforeseen consequences. Yeah, you got that right, you. Yep, yeah. Yeah, uh, I don't know. Yeah, you did your job well, didn't you? Yeah. Oh, let's get out of here. We need to leave. Oh god, oh don't like even the game can't take this. Even the fraps I mean. Oh, that's nice. Uh it is oh man. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No. I <laughs> so he was so averagely, averagely aged. Whoa, was that blood there before? Yeah, I'm guessing it was. I'm guessing. Whoa! Whoop. I don't really need a flashlight, did I? Oh, that guy's not gonna. He's not doing so good. Uh, oh no. Oh no. Oh, what's this? Oh, I'm actually supposed. Oh, I didn't know I was actually supposed to throw them. Playing around with objects, it turns out I meant to throw them. I wonder if the gravity gun's in this game. It probably isn't. It didn't close properly. Probably wasn't meant to. Oh, Dr. Klein is okay. Actually, that does sound like Eli. Except younger, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that was clever. All the falls are out. I can't reach anyone in the facility. We need to get to the surface and let someone know that we're stranded down. By Schrodinger's cat. Well, so you know there is a dead body right there. I mean, I don't want to alarm you, but. Ah, uh, oh, okay, he's just gonna... Act like it's everyday business. Yeah, I'm not gonna take it off, am I? Yeah. Hmm. What do you name... Let's not name it Lamar. Hey, oh! Huh, that's what I was thinking. I think that was what was on everyone's mind. Uh, I'm gonna go this way. 